Hello everybody, welcome back to another rank game. And we are here on the Nikoverse today. So let me see if I can gra grab that bow. Yeah, let's go. Ooh, lots of battle casts. So let's pick up the Illawis first. So we can sell the Shen, buy the Nocturnes. So we got a Jace from the item drop, two star Nocturne. So whenever I get a glove and a bow, one of the best items you can build is this. It's called Last Whisper, if you don't know what this item is. Uh, but basically, it reduces armor whenever your champion crits. So there's a lot of vanguards running around in this current meta. They're super, super popular. Uh, so just having Last Whisper in a lot of comps, any comps, like you could really use it on except for Star Guardians, it's a really good item. We got a Blitzcrank, so I guess we could go Blitzcrank. So I could sell some champions here for money or we keep the vanguard uh, and the reason why i might keep the vanguard in this case is because we have last whisper and last whisper generally is a good sniper item so snipers go well with vanguards but all right i think we'll buy the leona i don't feel like selling anyone right now okay we have a two star fiora we have the chrono bonus with caitlin Okay, let's go, Caitlyn. Let's go, Caitlyn. And I think I'm going to sell my Fiora. I think we want to just make money. Yeah, now we have just two main champions. That we will most likely not be using in, in most cases. I, I mean, we could have also sell the Malphite here, I think. Because Malphite and Illaoi, while they are nice to have... You know, we are probably not playing four brawlers, but maybe we won't because we do have them right now. So I'm going to go for, ooh, this vein is pretty good. But I think I want to go for the tier. Yeah, I'm going to go for the tier. So let's go to level five now. And Ash was a great pick because she gives us the sniper bonus with Ash. So you can see that we are gradually transitioning to snipers. Well, at least that is what I'm trying to do. Uh, but at the same time, we're just having some nice bonuses on the board here. And I think we might want to buy the Poppy. Maybe not. I don't think we need the Poppy right now. Yeah, actually, never mind. We won't buy the Poppy. And we'll make Econ this turn. So I don't even need the Leona. So let's just go Tangled. So another Dark Star player. Or did we already fight him? No, this is another one. There's, there's two of them. Okay. So let's grab another Jace, another Nautilus. So just grab the good bangers at this point. And hopefully my Ash can snipe away. Yes, she can. So let's sell the double mall fights. No reason to keep that. We got a Caitlyn here as well. And you want to scout every turn, of course. So I'm just going to do some scouting for you guys. So just to see what everyone's got. Infiltrators. Almost six chronos. Okay, he's pushing for the eight, I think. And then two Vanguard, two Mystic. Okay, Vanguard, Mystic, Star Guardians, Dark Star. There's a variety of different comps in this game. I don't see anyone with a very strong sniper team yet. Of course, most snipers are expensive champions, so you won't be seeing like too many heavy sniper comps in the beginning. Oh, this guy's going for the meat fast experience build. I think we're gonna beat him though. Team definitely doesn't look that strong. The early two sniper start is pretty good, especially if you had a two star Caitlyn by now, which we don't have, but okay, I guess I was wrong. He does have a strong enough team to beat us. Wow, his team looked really weak on paper, but okay, never mind. So let's go to level six, and we have a Nar. We want to get that because we're trying to get Teemo. Okay, so Teemo is going to be part of this build. So I'm going to sell the Nocturne because I'm just going to go two Vanguards for this turn. Yeah, we're just going to go two Vanguard this turn. And then last Whisper, let's give this to Ash. So she's just going to hold our items uh, for now until we get our late game carries. So with a tier, we're going to want to get a blue buff. Whenever you play Teemo, you want to get a blue buff for the guy. Ooh, nice. We got an early gin. And I did grab the Karma last turn. 
So let's sell the Ash and go for the Jin. I don't know about removing my two Vanguards yet, because the Vanguard armor is very nice to have in the early game. And even in the late game as well. So I didn't put in the Karma yet. So let's see if we can beat this with the Jin. Yeah, I think we can. Awesome. So let's grab the second tier for the blue buff. So we could buy the Cassiopeia and maybe consider putting in two Mystic with the Karma, but yeah, actually we could do that for now because she does have a low mana cost. It's just that I'd have to remove, I think it would be the two Vanguards, not the two Brawlers. Because I'd be losing the Chrono Bonus if I remove the Blitzcrank. And look at this Jin, yeah. Oh wow, we got Teemo Narvin. Okay, awesome. So we got Teemo, he's good to go. We also have three Astros right now. Keep that in mind. Um, so we could, ooh, we could go, who do I replace? We could go Teemo and then Nar for Ilawi. So when you have the Astro bonus and blue buff on Teemo, his mana goes down to 40. Right, and then he gets he gets 20 mana right after he casts his spell. Except for he got hit with the Ezreal debuff right there, but uh, he will do infinite bombs at this point. He's just gonna spam bombs, and this is a very, very strong Teemo build. We got a Wukong, so we don't need the Blitzcrank, or actually, this is up to you, okay? You can either keep the Blitzcrank or the Wukong if you play this build. And now I have to think about whether I wanna play four snipers or just two snipers because when I play this build I've had many success just playing two snipers you don't have to go for snipers so let's go to level 7 we got another gin so I'm gonna roll a little bit we got a blitz I'm trying to see if I want to keep the blitz we got a two-star vein so maybe it's four snipers for now uh, we you don't we don't need the Jace anymore. Okay. And let's go for a Morello. We also have Guardian Angel. And this would be good on Jin or Timo. I'm gonna wait a little bit, but this guy's going for Cybers. He has a three-star Leona already. But look at look at this Teemo doing so much damage. He's doing more damage than Jin. Wow, they gave us a triple Jace. We could actually use Jace instead of Uka right now. Oh wait, then we lose the Chrono bonus. I'm gonna Nico the Jin. Because in this comp, your primary carries are Teemo and Jin, and you could just Nico them early on. You could, you could, in fact, if you wanted to, as soon as you get the first Jin, you can use both of the Nico. This is a strategy to just two star Jin right away. Uh, that's if you want to just win streak really hard early on. We're not looking to get any powerful five gold champion in this comp. That's the great thing about snipers is that they don't actually need five golds. So I'm gonna go to level eight. Just gonna go fast eight. Should I go four vanguards? Well, let's see what everyone's got. So there is a lot of physical and magic damage mixed in. Yeah, there's a lot of mixes here and there. All right. So I just put Jace on the board for now. Just gonna use them. And do I need Janna? No, we don't. There's a guy with four Mystic, so Janna is actually worse. Remember, Janna converts your attack to magic damage, and Mystics give you magic defense, so you don't want to play Janna against four Mystics. Let's grab the Negatron Cloak, because I have a Giant Spelt. So, Negatron Giant Spelt, always go for the Zephyr. And yes, we could be putting in Karma for a Dark Star bonus, but I'd rather just put a two-star Jace. I, I need more tanks right now. 
Yeah, the Jace is very strong. But we can drop him later. Ooh, Dark Star Ribbon. I actually wanted to try Dark Star Ribbon. Too bad she got blew up in one millisecond. This team was very strong. I'm going to drop the Vayne and the Caitlyn, and I'm going to bring back the Blitz. So I'm going to go for one of my favorite Astro Sniper variants. There we go, two star Nar, two star Teemo. We got another Ash. For now, we're just going to keep this team though, because I don't have, I need to get a Lulu as well. Or I guess I could use Soraka. Yeah, actually we don't need to get Lulu. Lulu is the better Mystic, but Soraka could be good as well. Uh, and right now you can see Bomber Teemo doing so much damage. Still not changing my team, and this guy has 8 Chronos. 3 star Caitlyn, 3 star Twisted Fate. Let's see how strong this team is. Very curious about the 8 Chronos. Yeah, it looks like it's not good enough. Just as I thought. 8 Chronos I think are a bait. Or he has 7 Chronos right now. Never mind, he's still a level 7. Another Jin Karma. There we go, we got Soraka. Okay, so... Yeah, we can convert to the build I like to do. This is my Astro Sniper build. This is what you do. You get a ton of bonuses here. All right. So let's put Zephyr on the Gnar and then... All right, I'm gonna give that to him. See, I, I didn't really want to give this to Jin because I know Jin's attack speed doesn't go up, but his damage does go up as his attack speed supposedly goes up. Um, I was going to give Jin the Guardian Angel, but I decided, you know what? I want to make Teemo more of a focus in this game, so I decided to give that to Teemo. Let me grab the Celestial item. That could come in handy. So at this point, our goal will be try to try to 3-star Teemo all right, this is the Star Guardian, Candyland Poppy, Leona build. Wait, you should have given that to Victor, man. I don't know about that being on Leona. But you gotta love the Teemo, man. He's, he's definitely one of my favorite mid-set champions. Teemo is so fun. If you have this blue buff, it's so fun to see him bombing everybody. So this is the full Astro Sniper build. That is doing very well right now in the rank mode. Um, and I love playing this build. Definitely one of my favorite builds in the whole game because of Teemo. Teemo is actually so strong. He is not to be underestimated with. My favorite sniper champion is Teemo. Yes, Jin is doing a lot of damage, but Teemo, I gotta give credits for this guy. So we got another two star Jin on our way for three stars. So this guy has almost eight chronos. Six Star Guardian and Vanguard Mystic. All right, we get some gold coins and redemption. So I'm gonna roll down instead of leveling up. All right, another Nar. Yeah, why not? I like three starring Nar too. Another Teemo. Trying to find the Lulu. Ooh, Redemption. Let's give it to Nar. Yeah, I should have position better for this guy. He had the Blitz and the Zephyr in the corner. But it's all down to Teemo to bomb everybody. 3-star Ezreal down. 3-star Caitlyn. Twisted Fate about to go. Oh my god. He actually beat me because I didn't position well. Okay, I gotta pay attention. So now he has a 3-star Nico as well. All right. I think this guy's not a problem. The, even the other guy wasn't a problem if I had just not got my gem pulled. Like maybe if he hits his eight chrono, he might be a serious threat. I'm not sure. All right, let's keep rolling. Three star gen Teemo. Dude, get us that three star Teemo, dude. I need one more Teemo to make this happen. I'm still looking for Lulu, so I can use the Celestial Orb. 
or I could have just went to level 9, but I wanted to roll down to get 3-star Jin and 3-star Teemo. And at, th at this point, we have the strongest team. I highly doubt we're going to lose. There's no way. Yeah. Alright, come on, one Teemo. There we go. Man, I love 3 starting these guys. Boom, 3-star Teemo as well. Alright, it's the Star Guardian guy. Boom, hand of justice on the Jin double the damage and our shrooms are doing up to 720 damage on the Teemo. But right now Jin is overshadowing him with his huge damage. So so our next opponent has finally hit his Chronos. He finally hit eight Chronos. And let's see how strong he would be. Oh, we're not fighting him still. We're still fighting the Star Guardian player. So there's this guy. Uh, who's gonna die and then we have the chrono guy left so once again amazing bombs huge damage gin and did the other guy lose yes he did the chrono guy also lost to us so that's it simultaneously both of them went down i didn't have to use my celestial another rank game easily won thanks for watching guys this astro sniper is really strong so give it a shot have fun with it and I hope you guys enjoyed the video.